Hello friends, today I want to show off, today I want to brag. I've been practicing a lot of Terran as of late, and I decided that it would be a pretty good idea to show what I've been practicing. Basically like a seven-year-old coming home with his macaroni painting to show his parents, you guys are my parents, and all I really want is for you to say, wow, what a beautiful painting, Kevin. Please continue, you're going to be a great artist someday, even if you know that is not actually the truth. Enjoy today's video of Harstam's Terran Adventure. Alright, first opponent here is going to be Ace. Uh, it's a 5k Terran player. Against lower level Terran players, I usually tend to play a little bit less safe. But because today, you know, I really want to show off how good I've been, uh, how, how good I've been getting at this matchup and at this race in general. I'm going to be playing some, some proper StarCraft 2 today. So, second Reaper rather than straight into Reactor. Now, the theory why you play... Uh, less safe against lower level players is because even if they do end up reaper rushing you which is kind of a counter to reaper into reactor it generally is okay because their micro is so bad so um that is at least that's my theory i'm not sure if that's true in the case of ace but oh he's sick he's sick no oh my god how am i allowed to speak about micro oh my god i just move commanded my entire army is, is he proxying this? This felt like it was relatively quick now. <laughs> okay, I'm not allowed to speak about Micro no more. Oh my god. What is just two regular Hellions? And I don't think it is, right? I think this is this is something... This is something mean. This is something... You know, something bad here. Yeah, it's definitely something bad here. Okay, well. Let's see if my theory uh, holds up. I have a bad feeling that it might not. I'm not quite sure why I had freaking uh, four SEVs chasing uh, each other still there. That isn't entirely what we call brilliant, but maybe if I can clear this. Okay, that's one kill. It's going to be two kills. Three. One more. Oh, he's actually coming for me now, isn't he? He's going to be on top of this ramp. And piss off here. And make this move. Now, if this was as all-in as I think it was... Oh, he played Reactor first! That's what he did! He played Reactor first, this prick! Is that what he did? Okay, I have actually no clue what my opponent did here. Um, I'm gonna build a depot, though. Oh, no. Ace, why, why do you have to embarrass me like this? Is it, I never make these Terran videos. Where every single time I play Terran, all I do is just freaking cheese. And I'm like, okay, let me, let me show how, how solid my new play is. My, I've been freaking practicing for... For, 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 for a month and a half trying my absolute best and this is the best I have to show me move commanding two reapers into my opponent <sighs> life isn't fair this <laughs> is not fair <laughs> actually a little bit nervous as well yeah, I, I, felt, I remember when I was younger you sometimes would have like these um, these things you'd prepare which I, like your elementary school you know you like a little play or something for the parents. I always get so nervous. Like, oh, I gotta show the parents what we've been working on. You know, and even if it's not perfect, you know, we are we are young little actors. We can't sing either, and it was always musicals for whatever reason. Yet we always tried our hardest. That's what I feel like right now. It's like I'm, I'm once again, I'm a seven-year-old once more. Oh, please tell me I don't lose that mute. Thank you so much, dear friend. I want to see what's over here though. And it's actually fairly important. Yeah, work account doesn't even look so bad for me. If I get two kills on this, I'll be happy too. Come on, kill that. There you go. Two kills. Three kills. Ah, oh, right. I killed that Marine as well. Um, we're going to go into Triple Raven. Oh, he's going to get some kills here as well. I think that was so far one. Now, if he kills more Marines, it's going to be more. Let's see if we can actually go in and see if we can find fight him. Um, this is going to be the last harassment I'm going to be doing, by the way. Because I really want to just kind of move out on the map and, and go for it, I think. Although I don't really have the, the numbers for that either. I, I don't really have... I I just don't think my position is so good. Still gonna try my best, though. Still gonna try my best. I always try my best. It's the most important thing in StarCraft. Well, winning is the most important thing. But if you can't win, which, you know, that has been an issue for me in the past few years, then trying hard is also something to be proud of. You know, that's what I keep telling myself, at least. You know, I might not have won again. Yes, I went out in the first round, but... And gave it my all. In a way, that's even sadder, you know? If you didn't give your all and went out in the first round, at least you can say, well, I didn't even really try. But I try every single time, and then I lose. Like, well, that's depressing. This was my best. Like, freaking Cyril goes out hunting and fishing every other day. Plays golf 16 hours a day. He's not trying his hardest yet. 
outperforms me every single day of the week. He's unbelievable. All right. I want uh, Stim, because that's important for me. Ooh. What are you doing, mate? I think he's going to do something silly. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Did you see that? Am I not world's greatest timing machine? It's not a word, but if it was, I would be the world's greatest timing machine. I love that I just have random SEVs just standing at my command center, waiting for them to be ordered around. So watching myself play Age of Empires when I was nine. Oh, here we go. You really want to go in there? Because I, I don't actually think you do, mate. Icky, he's, he's all in, isn't he? Oh, my man is so all in. He's, he is. He's just... He, oh, that was good for me. Right? I mean, this is it. This, I don't think he has a third. Oh, good call. <laughs> I don't know why I speak half the time either. <laughs> I really don't know. <laughs> I swear, it, it's not my intention that whenever I say something, that it is always going to be wrong. Okay, this is that's a coincidence. This is not something I truly aim for. <laughs> if it was something I was aiming for, you would you would you would think it's pretty impressive, but it's not because I, I don't do it on purpose. Okay, I believe the things I say and I'm just wrong all the time. Uh, the opposite rule applies to me. Is there a random SUV here somewhere? No, I thought I saw that. That would have been real sad. Now, his third base has been established a bit later. My tank count is extremely low uh, because I have been sucking at macro. I really don't understand that. I swear I was playing so well. Like, what triggered this is that this morning I was playing some games. I was like, oh, man, I'm so good with Terran. Can't wait to, <laughs> to show the boys and girls on YouTube. <laughs> They're going to be so impressed <laughs> with my tricks. <laughs> and then this happens. <laughs> Come on, guys. <laughs> this isn't fun for me either. I can play like a freaking clown. I, I'm more nervous here than I was in the freaking uh, EPT Masters or at Katowice. You know, at Katowice, I felt good, but in the end, you look at the other players like, yeah, kind of expecting to lose. But here, I'm playing against Ace. He's 5k MMR. It's not bad, but you know, this, I've been beating these guys for the past few weeks in solid macro games as well. I am feeling myself when it comes to this matchup, you know? <sighs> We're gonna need two more of these. I accidentally build a. Uh, what you call it first? A, uh... Ooh, that's actually kind of scary. Build a fort base before the other stuff, which is actually not that great. It's really not that brilliant at all. He's definitely coming here, and he... Oh, what? That's not a good move, mate. Does he have upgrades yet? No, it doesn't have upgrades yet either. I feel like we can go at this point. I knew he was here. I could smell it. See, these are the Terran instincts. I didn't want to talk about my instincts until they, they truly showed. But these are this is exactly, you know, this is what they call game sense, my friends. This is what they call game sense. Just what I showed there. Okay, let's go in. Let's go kill him. Let's go kill this guy. I smell everything. Okay. More game sense, more game sense. Look at this move. Oh, there was two tanks in there, wasn't there, buddy? <laughs> Boom! Straight into the the crown jewels. And a punch. Boom. Uppercut into the crown jewels. He's screaming. I'm screaming, but for different reasons. <sighs> nice. Nine points. And we're actually getting pretty close to an MMR record as well on this account. Well, in general, I think. I don't think I've ever really been above... I've never been above 5.7 in, in recent times. So we're getting closer. We're not there yet, but we're getting closer. The hands are fast. The brain works like a machine. Overall, I am what, we, what most people would consider in a very good mood. Fiond, this guy is my nemesis. <laughs> This guy's my nemesis. He always beats me. My early game is very good versus him. Okay. He yeah, like actually my nemesis. And this prick, he also killed me the other day with a with a rope mm, with a roach all in. I'm I'm starting to develop like uh, real hatred for certain players and also like mini rivalries with my off race. Like I'm really getting into it. I feel like almost like a you know these these I think they're called method actors. It's like the 
you have like an actor or an actress and they'll uh, they'll start living like the character that they're supposed to be playing you know so they're they're playing some uh, you know they, they're all from la and they start playing like a, a, a redneck from the deep south and they start start living like them you know start living on a farm copy the accent completely and they just completely get in that mind space write like a backstory for it as well you know so they can understand the character more this is kind of what i feel like as well with my terran is it like i started role playing as a terran but now i'm 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 sometimes when i lose to protos i can feel something boiling inside of me that wasn't there before you know i've changed like i'm a the the, the, the neurology of my brain has been altered in a significant way I, I, I guess if you look at me pre-Terran and post-Terran, I probably also look different, uglier, I would say, most of the time. That tends to be the case. Um, yeah, if you, you pictures from me from like a, maybe like a year ago or so, you're like, oh, that's a handsome guy. And I was like, ooh, he hasn't, uh, you know, he hasn't been outside for a while, his life must suck. Stuff like that. Just, just generally, I start sweating more at just random occasions, just from my, my eyebrows as well. Like, just below it. You know, it's the worst location to sweat. Not many people know this, but... Uh, usually when you sweat above your eyebrows, like your eyebrows, they they whisk away the sweat. That's what the eyebrow was invented for in the in the late 1700s. They introduced it. And they were like, well, we need something to get rid of all that sweat dripping into our eyes. Like, oh, what about uh, this brushy crap? When I put it in the genetic code, and here we are. But... <clears throat> I right now have started developing sweat that starts below my eyebrow, which completely defeats the purpose of the of the eyebrow. It's very, very unfortunate for me, of course. Um, but I, I, I so I, I googled, you know, it's like how to deal with, uh, with 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 sweat under the eyebrow, and then you just get redirected to the Terran section of the Battle Net forums. This, this is this is a, a very local phenomenon. It really only happens to Terran players. So we need like a. Now they're thinking of adding in a second eyebrow, like under the first one, like kind of on your eyelid. But then you'll see that Terran players will just start sweating from their eyelid, like, or just straight into the eye, like straight to the source, you know? There's just truly really no winning. I think that gas is too fast. I'm pretty sure that gas is too quick here. Oh, that, that gas is definitely too fast. Very nice, Kevin. Oh God, I love it. Here you are spending all your time practicing Terran build orders. Can't even uh, do, a, do a proper Banshee opener, the most standard of all Harstam. God, are you even a real Terran? Yes, but this is also another thing, is that Terran players, they don't actually know their build orders, they just build things when they feel like it should be. Especially at the lower levels, even some of the higher level Terrans, they don't actually quite understand how their build is supposed to work. It's like, yeah, just, I take a guess when I feel like I need it. It's like an intuitive race, like, no! Starcraft is a scientific thing, okay? You need to measure it, you need to have a proper response to everything. These guys just kind of feel. A lot of Terrans also don't have Sim City. Neither do I when I play Terran, but it is unbelievable. I ask some Terrans, like, hey, how do you Sim City against Forgate Blink? And they're like, what do you mean Sim City? I'm like, well, the way you position your build. This is a true story. This is an actual conversation I have with high level Terrans. Like, I'm not even memeing now. Can you believe that? No, I can. Um, so, this is a trick that I would like to show. I'll start a tech lab. So now I'll think, oh. <laughs> Tech lab? Yeah, I'm a smart Zerg player. <laughs> That's bio. That's hilarious. He thinks I can't read that? Why would he build it right in my face? Build it right in your face because I'm tricking you, you clown. I'm not the one that is being tricked. You're the one that's being tricked. This is a fake tech lab. Boom. It's like a fake moustache, but better. Because it's a tech lab. Um, can I get some of these? If I can get this, that would be high tier as well. And poof. Piss off with it. And just like that. What do we do? Exactly. Gases. What? No, 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 no. Oh. Oh, wait. What am I attacking here? This thing goes so well. I don't really have a good mineral patch here to go into. Well, could have done it better, I guess. I wonder if he knows that I'm playing mech now. I feel like we've made it... Maybe a little bit too obvious, even. Where's everything going? Oh my god. How could this happen? I freaking hate this guy so much. Fiant. Fiant, Fiant, Fiant. It's a nice name, but this guy's a prick. He plays like a prick, at least. He might be a nice guy. I don't actually know very much about him. 
Good lord. This is some of the most atrocious micro I've seen in my life. Lost two mules there for free. Oh my god, come just leave me alone, you massive clown. Think I can go in here? No, I don't think so. I think that might have been a mistake, actually. Oh my god, I'm getting completely destroyed here. This is embarrassing. This isn't even remotely good, you know that? Like, this isn't even being... It really isn't being close to being good. This is This was pathetic. I regret everything. Maybe you go die. At least we get some kills here. No? I don't think I've been producing workers this entire time either. Yeah, mate, that's freaking brilliant. Why, why is it like, hmm, right now? Wait, he has two spores? What is that? Who built two spores? What have you been hit by, my friend? Oop. Yeah, we're just gonna go in now. He needs to move his queens back in the main. Yeah. Oh, wait, what? Well, like, what is he actually doing, though? Surely he's over here, no? No, come on, we need to go in. We need to go in, Chief. So we're playing Banshee, Mac. Okay, let's just rally everything over here. It feels like... Oh, 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 oh. Uh, how slow does he think I... Oh, that's not a wall. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Okay, let's go. And then we'll hope for the best, I guess. He doesn't have that much creep. Does not have that much creep, does he now? Is he dying? I think he might be dying, huh? That was not great. I repeat, that was not great. Look how much cash I have as well. Oh my god, I should have not said anything. I should have said, hey guys, I'm just gonna show you some Terran games. I haven't played this game in five years. Let's see how it goes. And then you, everyone would have been so impressed. Like, wow, he hasn't played in five years and this is the level he's at? <laughs> Man, this Hearthstone kid really has a talent. i definitely subscribe to his YouTube channel. But now, now you see the truth. I freaking practiced 500 games. What is what these guys doing? And I get worse. I can't perform under pressure. Oh, it's a sad world we live in. I feel like he's gonna do something stupid. What? Maybe I'm the stupid one. Oh, he's gonna come in here or what? He really believes in, in these in these run buys, doesn't he? Prick. Well, that wasn't the greatest defense either, but let's see what we can do. La 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 Ooh, that wasn't so great. Is he just massing links? Surely this is legitimately the worst call you can make, no? Well, not the worst call you can make. The worst call you can make is uploading a video, introducing by saying that you're a, an improved Terran player, and then showing gameplay like you're four years old, and this is your second game. No offense to any four-year-olds that are watching this, you're probably better than I am. Oh, piss off! You also piss off though with the drones, huh? Die, 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 my darling. I think I'm winning this fight now. He's Hydra. What? I have no clue if I'm winning or not, but I have a. F no, come on! Come on, die. That felt good. Not sure if it was though. No, that was definitely good actually. Who am I kidding? Does he have any banes? If he has no banes, do I just not win the game here? Where's this one? Go back in. Look at me go. Freaking battle mecker. Losing all of his workers as well. Here, kill this hatch. Ooh. 
That's not great. I think I won. I'm telling you, this is my nemesis. If I take him out, that would be uh, that would be a massive win. I didn't play so well though. Huh? That definitely wasn't so great. Oh, invis. Oh, there's a flank. Can I turn this into? Maybe I shouldn't have done it mid fight, but maybe I should. I'm telling you, this race plays itself, my friends. Do I have a fifth base yet? Another nemesis taken out. Is he pulling drones against Hellbats? That's not a very bright move. That is not a very bright move. Oh yeah, more high, more hydras. Hudra, 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 lisk. Pa, 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 da, da, da. This is, you know what this is, my friends? Destruction. <laughs> <laughs> Poof! Straight on the snout. Poof! <laughs> Almost hit my own camera there. That would have been an expensive little joke for the YouTubes. Woo! You instantly find a new game, hopefully. And uh, well, we don't. But I'll see you there anyway. Rank 66. They call me the Devil Protoss for a reason. Yeah, they do. Up next, we have Jungle Balls. We put on some, We even put on the StarCraft music for this because this is going to be a banger. This dude is five seven. Okay, five point seven kmmr. This is. He is where I want to be. You know. You ever. You ever have that? Ever had this in like elementary school or in high school? You look to some like some other person in your so it's like man i wish we could trade places i wish i could do that with jungle balls but just for my terran skill but then the moment i trade places with him i'll look at the the five eight i'm like i wish i was five eight maybe it'd be smarter that if i get one trade place that i would just immediately swap with clam or something rather than going to jungle balls but still it this feels more realistic you know I rub the lamp, the genie comes out, they go like, I want to get Clem's Terrence. He goes like, oh, 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 oh. Remain realistic in your wishes, my friends. Like, all right, jungle balls then. He's like, jungle balls? He's 5760. Lower, you know. You're a crap genie, holy cow. <laughs> you can only give me 100 MMR extra? Like, what's wrong with you? I don't even want to talk with you. Back in your lamp, son. He goes back in his lamp. Idiot. Should have become a genie. It's really not that hard to not be a genie either, no? I don't know, actually. I don't know the lore behind the genies. Bet there's something messed up there as well. I feel like a lot of these... Uh, these them, them fairy tales, you know, they... They sound so nice, but then you read the actual story and... It's a lot more cruel than, than, than Disney portrayed it to be, you know? I remember reading the story of The Little Mermaid. Uh, when I was fairly young, and it didn't... It wasn't necessarily a sad, like, a, a really bad ending, but it also wasn't so good. I think she ended up as foam on the ocean or something like that, if I recall correctly. I was like, man, this is a terrible end ending. I'm six. Why would my parents give this to me? I have no clue. Now, this player is higher level. Um, we're going to be showing what I like to call the Beyond build, okay? Because Beyond played this build. And he explained, I actually asked Beyond. This is not a joke. Most of my communication with Beyond, rather than me asking about like TVP replays or it's like, hey, I suck with Protoss, explain to me what I should be doing better. I usually just ask him for builds. It's like, hey, do you have any new TVT builds? And it's like, yeah. And he'll explain to me how the TVT build works. <laughs> this is how I'm using my my tight connection with one of the world's greatest Korean Terrans. He's giving build orders to someone that is uh, 700 MMR lower. No, 1700 MMR lower. So, yeah. But he's okay with it, you know? And if, as long as both of us are happy, then I'm happy too. I think I'm supposed to get a second Hellion, actually. I couldn't remember the build for a second. I actually, this is the one that I literally haven't played in a while. Literally. Legit literally. Literally. Um, <clears throat> I have supply block. I don't think that's supposed to happen either. But whatever. Here's what it is. Man, my eyebrows are sweating already. Oh, life is so difficult as a Terran player. Uh, it smells so bad as well. Oh no. Okay. This guy's going to the low ground. I feel like we're going to get into a base trade scenario. My CC will never finish. I'm going to be super fuming. Like super fuming. Uber fume. Da -da -da. What are you doing, you prick? What? Piss off jungle balls. What do you think you're doing? 
think we can fight it? What? Who plays like this? But who really freaking plays like this? Oh my god. He went like a uh, deeper Hellion. Starport? With a reactor on it. Oh, Jungle Ball's an idiot. How was I supposed to know that then? This guy's been hit on the head a couple too many times. This guy's gonna ruin my streak. I'm gonna be super upset. I can I can tell you that already, okay? Super upset. He's he's tricking me away right now from the natural and it's working. Why is it working? It's because I'm an idiot. No no no, you're staying home. Until he's gonna come in at some point. You know it already. It's gonna it's gonna be Vikings or something. What? Who is this legendary operator? Huh? Look in this crystal ball where my freaking uh, reapers are, prick. If I was a lesser person, I'd call him a map hacker, but then his response to my initial three reaper, two hellion run by would have been really bad. So, you know, you always, you can immediately dispel this. You know, if you ever think to yourself, oh, this guy's a hacker, just watch the replay. And you'll know soon enough if he's a hacker or not. Most of the time, at least. What is he doing? That's not a build. This guy plays like a prick. No, this guy is a prick. That's a cool build, though. What in the world? Freaking jungle balls. Oh, this I appreciate. Is this the Penguin Brothers build? This looks freaking cool. Gas first. Oh my god, I'm gonna steal this build. This seems so brain dead as well. Yeah, that's a great way to end. That's actually a fantastic way to end. Really getting schooled in this matchup. Freaking jungle balls. Alright, jungle balls. 18 points for you. This is how I'll end it. Thanks all so much for watching. If you did enjoy this episode of playing Terran games and showing off my macaroni paintings, be sure to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see more of you in future videos. Thank you. And bye-bye.